is a company that is very committed to promote oral health uh, and a future to, to smile about. And, and Colgate collaborates with dental professionals all over the world uh, to promote uh, oral health and advanced care. And these partnerships with dental professionals are very important for Colgate to be in the forefront of innovation, education, community outreach, and, and everything related to dentistry. And uh, particularly uh, dental students that are the, the future dental professionals, uh, Colgate wants to connect with them and to empower them and to support their entire journey as dental students because we want to be their indispensable partner uh, when they become dental professionals and we want to be in their hearts and their minds. So uh, through research, we discovered that dental students, uh, they are looking for content to fill in the gap uh, of their university education. Uh, so based on that, we designed and created the student app that, uh, that is an easy to use platform that has uh, snackable, compelling, engaging content from credible and well-known uh, universities and institutions uh, that can complement dental students' education. When the whole concept of doing this application came up, it really was a process of how are we engaging with the future professional? We really didn't have a way of engaging with them. We didn't have a way of really uh, incorporating them well into our ecosystem in terms of what other platforms we have. Um, so there were, were some of the challenges and that we really didn't have a way to capture them early and then continue with them as they progress into the profession. So what we looked at is how can we do that? How can we engage them early and really keep them in our ecosystem throughout the whole professional career that they have? And the reason that um, this in this process, it really was something that was a challenge and that we spoke to students. We went to them globally to find out what do you really need and what do you really want from us? And in that discovery process, we really found out that they want to engage with us and they want more of a two-way conversation. It really was, you know, not just Colgate giving them Colgate marketing or advertising it was really what their needs were they were feeling that there were gaps in their education they wanted to really have something in the palm of their hand that they can look up really quickly um, we found that they were going to things like youtube instagram TikTok, getting information that might not be good information that really might have derailed them in their education and we felt that was a really good opportunity for us to kind of fill a gap that was missing and bring them really evidence-based, reliable content from university partners and experts in the field. And the other key thing is they wanted it in their hand instantly. They don't want to go looking for it. They want a one-stop shopping, which is really how the consumer works today. A, a big stepping stone for Colgate because it's kind of pulling us definitely into the 21st century in terms of technology. We have had apps before, but nothing really that that has this um, profound an effect because it is global. All our hub regions are using it. It's a way for us to engage with, with customers and students. Um, it, it definitely is slightly different. It is relevant because now we're capturing them for marketing, which we weren't um, really able to do before. So it, it's really fitting nicely and setting the stage for how we pull in other um, parts of our business into this ecosystem. When I say it's, you know, we want them to have one login so that they could go and see everything that Colgate has to offer in one spot. So that has changed for us in a po very positive manner. app from other apps are four main things. The first one is that it was completely designed and developed for dental students specifically. Uh, as Diane mentioned, uh, before launching the app, we did a lot of research to learn what the students would be interested to learn, what they would engage with. Uh, so since the structure of the app, the different categories 
that we have for content, the features and the functionalities, everything was designed based on what the users want to see and learn. Uh, we have a dedicated team that is focused on continuous improvement of content and functionalities. And they are doing everything based on user feedback and real-time data. So this is the first thing. The second thing is the variety of content in different areas that makes the, the platform very complete and relevant for dental students. So we have content about dental procedures, patient care and communication, trends and innovations in the industry, practice management, how to be there, build their career, sustainability, volunteering, many other areas that students are interested in and want to learn more about. So this is the second thing. The third thing is uh, that we have very strong content partners. Um, we are partnered with very well-known and credible uh, universities and institutions such as UPenn, Foresight, University of Manchester, Columbia University, many others, and this really makes us very relevant for students. And, and the fourth thing is that it's a global app. So the app is in more than 20 languages and available for all countries. The students um, from all over the world, they can interact with the other dental students and know what the other students are commenting and learning about. So it makes very appealing for the students as well. The process of implementing the SMILE application within Colgate really was a definitely a group effort. We pulled in um, people in marketing and education from our different regions to really pull together to kind of build um, excitement about the app, build buy-in to the app, because with any new kind of um, tool, it really does require some education involved. Um, one of the things that I think really set this apart is really being able to use the dashboard that we have created that's very interactive and timely up to the minute, because I think being a very data-driven um, company, you need that data to kind of drive you forward and to decide what direction you need to go. And once people see the data and really understand how it will help and, and improve what they do on a day-to-day -day basis and how it can help them reach out to the new professionals, I think that really changed how it was looked at as a tool. Um, lots of excitement. Once they really see that it, it is starting to gain momentum and how many students we've got engaged. So that's been really good. We do a lot of um, internal PR in this too, because I think that's important um, to get buy-in on, on an application like this and really get people to say, you know what, I'm interested. I want, I want to see this succeed because with any project like this, you really need people promoting it internally. So I think that's been a really, big plus in also just sharing. We're very open with communication as to what's happening, what's going on. And that's really helped gain um, a lot of um, insights from the team as to what, what is working well for them and what's working well as an organization for us. So um, I would say that's probably um, really the key to making this a success. rollout what we do is we get feedback all the time on every single part of the um, app um, we have us I have a student uh, focus group we have student ambassadors we get feedback from them and it's been really positive um, with each step that we've Im improved such as user experience the speed of the download the content download it really has changed I just spoke to some students last night and they were like oh my god it loads so much faster i like it so this is great so they're seeing the changes that we're having to implement with um Infra pro and and how responsive they are and how it's really helping get the app um kind of out there and more used so i appreciate that um and it is true that data, the dashboard has been great because then we can say, you know, students aren't looking at this, but they are looking at this. So in terms of content, we go, let's do more of this. Let's do more videos. Let's do more 
um, flashcards. Let's, you know, what do they want? And we can see that data and, and be more agile in terms of what we're doing. We are lucky to have Confonel team as our partners to develop this dashboard that Diane mentioned uh, that can provide us real-time access to the user interactions. So on top of monitoring how many students from all over the world are joining the platform, we really want to make sure the students are engaged. engaged. So we are monitoring very closely their engagement. Um, because they we want them to use the app in their daily routine as a dental student, um, not only one-time thing. So um, the future of the app is 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 just so broad. There's so many opportunities. Um, we are. Um, working on forums so the students when I told you before about student engagement they want to be able to engage real time so we're going to be working on um, a forum and possibly having an ask the expert each month so they can ask questions of an expert because they want that opportunity to maybe ask questions that they couldn't ask in class because they don't feel comfortable um, I think we're always looking to make it modern um, really um, definitely dynamic in terms of keeping it you know, new and fresh. So I think that's something we're looking at even now, it's only been like a, a year and a half and we're now looking at how do we refresh the look of it because you wanna keep it you know, modern and fresh for the students. So the, there's always new features. Um, I looked at something called ChatEase, which is an AI um, translator or filter search engine. So we're looking at the new things that are coming down the road and how can we incorporate that into the app. So um, we're excited for those opportunities. Uh, so my recommendations, advices would be, the first thing would be before starting any platform development, it's very important to do the foundational work to collect insights uh, and understand what you are really trying to solve. Uh, the second thing is to find the right partner to develop the application because based on my experience leading other platform developments and uh, digital platforms, um, the partner should be agile, flexible and, and committed. So it's very important. And the third advice would be Keep a very close relationship with, with your future users to design the best user experience for them. So uh, we are lucky to have Componel team as our partners to develop this dashboard that Diane mentioned uh, that can provide us real-time access to the user interactions. So on top of monitoring how many students from all over the world are joining the platform, we really want to make sure the students are engaged. engaged. So we are monitoring very closely their engagement um, because they we want them to use the app in their daily routine as a dental student, um, not only one time thing. I, I think we, couldn't have selected a better partner, so we are extremely satisfied with Componel because on top of all the expertise that uh, Componel has provided us, um, all the agility and responsiveness, so they are always, the team is always on top of all the, the issues and the new crazy things that we, we come up, as Diane was mentioning, um, and also the flexibility so uh, many times we change it plans and it happens right because uh, the priority sometimes changed and and they they were able and open to go with us and adjust the plans so we are extremely satisfied with with Componel. on top of the the expertise the team is extremely professional, committed, agile, responsive, flexible. Um, we are very satisfied with the, the team that we have been working on. The 
I actually already recommended Componel internally for a couple of other projects. Um, because again, I trust uh, Componel, all the expertise that is helping us can help other Colgate businesses and also other companies to succeed as we are succeeding with the student app.